Welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Christina Kay. And while I mainly focus on Disney content here, we're going to talk a little bit about both today. Disney and lifestyle favorites that I have recently got from Amazon. I have been buying stuff from Amazon over the years, but I figured let me get to some of my recent things, the top 10 things that I am loving this year. Things I purchased this year that I think most of them, if not all of them, are still available on Amazon. Now, if I was talking about my overall favorites, my vlogging camera, I bought that last year. My blue light glasses that I swear by, they make such a difference. Um, my Tervis, which I need to find. I use these things every single day, basically. Um, but these are the items that I'm loving for this year. And I would love to know in the comments below, what are some things you've been getting from Amazon that you just love? I've ordered quite a few Halloween costumes over the years on Amazon or like accessories for it. And yesterday, who did I just order parts of one of my costumes because I do multiple costumes and I'm hoping it is amazing. Fingers crossed. This video is not sponsored by Amazon. They have no idea who I am or what I'm doing, but I just really love a lot of the products. So I wanted to share that with you guys. And I also would highly recommend when buying something, make sure that it says free returns. That is really big for me. I can go to like a Whole Foods or a UPS store, just scan the label, don't even have to box it up, drop it off, and it makes life so much easier. And that's why I feel like I will buy a lot from them because it's not too risky for me. Over the years, I've gotten like some really cool Disney finds on Amazon, like Funko Pops. I wouldn't recommend getting ears. I've been burned with ears on Amazon. I um, know I'm not the only one, but the like probably the coolest Disney thing, literally coolest <laughs> Disney thing I've ever gotten. And you guys probably know what it is. I've been obsessing over it lately are these fans. You can get them Disney or non-Disney. They have like pineapple ones. They have just a bunch of different designs. This, I got this on a whim before I went on a Disney cruise and went to Walt Disney World in July, which shameless plug, all of those videos will be in the description box below. It was July. I went to Disney in May and I was suffering then. I was like, there's no hope for me in July. So I got one for me and my twin sister who's even more picky than me. The two of us loved, loved, loved them. We use them in the parks, on the ship, at Castaway. I'm packing them for my next Walt Disney World trip and other trips I have coming up, which stay tuned. That's probably the next couple of videos you will see. Editing Christina, I wanted to also quickly add that they're lightweight because they're not batteries. They're rechargeable. And if you carry a lounge fly backpack, they fit right in the side compartment. It's amazing. I can't rave about this enough. I have bought this as gifts. I will leave the link of the one that I got in the description box below. And any links that I leave are not affiliate links. I don't get any bit of a kit back. I don't know how that works, to be honest with you. <laughs> I haven't figured that part out yet. So I'm just gonna link them because I genuinely want you guys to check them out. So many of you guys have said you love this too. This had to be the first thing I mentioned, it had to. The second thing is probably the thing I use the most and that is my phone case for my iPhone. In January, I got a new phone. I was like, I need a new case. I want it to be protective because you're paying so much money for these phones. I wanted it to be Disney too. So I got this OtterBox case. Sorry, there's a little bit of a glare didn't come with the pop socket. The pop socket I got as a gift for my birthday and it just kind of went. This has been so protective. I bought a phone case in the parks and it was like wearing away. It wasn't doing good. This is amazing. I do drop my phone. I use my phone a lot. I highly recommend OtterBox phone cases. I know they sell some in the parks too and they sell some with pop sockets. I think my sister has one of those, but I love the feel of this one. It went with the blue of my phone. Yeah, this had to be a favorite I mentioned too. And it was cheaper than I thought. It was actually cheaper than some like regular plain phone cases in stores. Okay, buckle up. We got some random things, but there's a reason why I'm mentioning it. Do you wear like Tom's? I wear a bunch in the parks or like Steve Madden sneakers on a daily basis, but the socks that don't fall down show and they just don't look right. And then the ones that are no show, they, they're on your toes by the time you get out your driveway this pair from adidas oh my goodness do i love this pair so much i got my first set at tj maxx but they had like a 10 pack on amazon they have plain ones they have ones with like little color wash down here these lines i love them they don't fall down they are comfortable this is like exclusively what i wear now in the summer when it comes to socks and in the parks you could walk around the parks all day 
it is fan fantastic. Even if you're not going to the parks, you're just living your life. They're amazing. When I got sick in May, I didn't really want to wear makeup, but I knew when I was filming stuff or at work, I had to wear a little bit. I'm constantly on camera, so I wanted to just look a little perfected. And this is something that I've been loving for a while. It made it on one of my monthly favorites videos. Oh my goodness. It's the Misha BB cream. At first, I did not like this stuff, but now I do. The shade range is not great. I'll be honest. This is a lighter shade. This is like my winter shade. Right now, I have it on today. I'm wearing shade 23. I wore it for my cruise. So many of you asked what I was wearing because my skin looked great. It's this. I just got my sister hooked on this. You can't really find it at too many places. I got a two-pack on Costco during the pandemic. They don't sell it anymore, but you can get a two-pack on Amazon for like, I think $25 for two foundations that are gonna last you a while. It's a pretty good deal. It's got SPF in it, so it's perfect for the parks. I love it, love it, love it, love it. I do wear a powder on top of mine too in, in some places on my face, but it is pretty decent coverage. It's medium coverage. You could build it up, obviously, but I love this stuff. So let's talk about Amazon clothing. It could be very hit or miss. I understand. My dress today is actually from Amazon. I do have a bunch of favorites that are dresses. Problem is right now, they are packed. I'm taking them on my trip. So you're gonna see a pack with me in the next couple of videos. All those dresses will be in that. So make sure you're subscribed because they are some real winners. I mean, I'm taking them on vacation with me. They must be good. This one today is um, kinda, it, you have to like steam it when you wear it. It's nice, it's lightweight, it's flowy, it does the trick. But the ones that I'm like really loving and like a cover up and all that are in the pack with me. But I wanna talk about these skirts. So my sister made me this custom skirt when I did the cruise broadcast. It's a plain black skirt, which I do have these in plain colors, but whenever I make custom skirts for my broadcast, which broadcast, by the way, I work in radio, I get to do my radio show in a bunch of cool places we're doing two really cool ones coming soon. Again, subscribe so you don't miss that. But when we did the Disney cruise, I wanted to have a cruise skirt and my sister made this custom one. It's so nice. Like she put all these on there. I don't know how she did it, but she did it and it's amazing. The skirt is comfortable. It doesn't wrinkle when you pack it. I mean, just plain black, it's nice. Two, I just ordered a navy blue one for my trip. I have lighter blue ones that my friend Brittany actually like sewed Slinky Dog on when I opened Toy Story Land. So I have to lint this. It does stick to, some stuff does stick to it, um, but they're comfortable. They are amazing. The only problem I have with that, which can be a problem with Amazon, is the stock. They don't have every color. They usually always have black, maybe a brown, a gray, a navy, but some of the other colors, not always. I haven't seen the bright colors this year, but I also haven't been looking for them. To go with the skirt, I usually will paint shoes, but I did something different this time. I took a pair of Keds and I sharpied Goofy and Donald in their little sailor outfits, and it was really actually kind of easy to do. Easier than painting, I thought, and I had to make that decision medically. So I did Sharpies and I got like a 24 pack of these thin Sharpies, which were perfect. But if you look at Goofy, he's got a skin color face and I didn't want to make it pink or an orange. I wanted to like do it right. Goofy's my favorite character. I didn't want to butcher it, but you don't get Sharpies in that color. I found a pack of these skin colored markers. Oh, and this is a better way to show you. I can't believe I found these. These are great if you've got kids who want to color, um, if you like to color, do art, if you like to paint, whatever. Just note, like for the shoes, if you're into that kind of stuff, these do bleed a little bit, so you have to um, be very careful around the edges. You kind of have to go far away from it because it will bleed out, but it ended up being perfect. There was no bad bleed out where it went outside the lines. Got a color in the lines. Um, yeah, I am very, very, very proud of the way he came out. It's not my best shoe design, but for the condition I was in and like the, sh I had like a week to do it, it worked out. I hope you can get these shoes on Amazon because I, I really loved these. These were super comfy and the Adidas socks work perfect with them. The necklace I'm wearing today is from Amazon. It's actually the first time I am wearing it. So I'm getting used to it. I can't say it's a favorite, but usually when I wear necklaces here, they're either Disney or they're ones that have my initial on it. And every time I post a video, I'm not even kidding. Every time I post a video on Instagram and in my Insta stories and I have 
the necklace on. So many of you ask where it came from. It's Amazon. So like I said, I have a gold one. I just got this silver one with like this toggle chain there. These are so comfortable. I have extremely sensitive skin, especially in my neck. Um, and these have been amazing. They usually come with like, an oh, do I have it here? Yeah. It comes with another chain so you can layer it. I have this in gold, rose gold, now silver. I love these so much. Um, gotta give a shout out to Jessica Braun here on YouTube because she's the one who got me hooked on that and the Misha BB cream, if you know, you know. One of my all time favorite things I've ever ordered on Amazon, and again, I get so many questions about where I got it or how I could afford it because so many people think it's real. It's so not real, guys. <laughs> it's my Gucci, fake Gucci, my Fucci belt. I mean, I've had celebrities think it was real. I, I love this belt so much. I can't find it anymore. So I just got something that's kind of dupe-ish, I guess. Um, it's not, they're not G's, but they're like almost C looking. I got this brown color. I also have it in black and white, came in a nice little pack. I wish they came in silver too, because I do have a lot of things that I wanna wear silver with. And I love a good statement belt. I these are great though because it's not too big. You could wear it with dresses. You could wear it with your jeans. So cute, so complimented, so comfortable. I discovered so many things on Amazon, now that I think about it, when I was getting ready for my trip because I was sick with COVID. I couldn't go anywhere. Um, I was reading reviews and something that I read is that you do a lot of walking on Castaway and people have like their flip-flops or their sandals broke. And I wanted something with cushion, something that was gonna give me support and be good for me. And I ordered these reef flip-flops. Sorry, they're a little dirty. I just had a pool day yesterday. They are cushy. This is so soft. I highly recommend this. It didn't squeak when my feet were wet. They were comfortable to walk and you do a lot of walking on Castaway. Again, if you know, you know. But I got the black. I kind of want them in navy. It was amazing. The price was so much better on Amazon than online, but I do hear that sometimes Reef does have sales, but for me, it was just easier. Amazon, free shipping here in like the next day. So like I said, the dresses, I'm gonna show a bunch in my pack with me. I think I have, yeah, I have one here that I love too and I've gotten so many compliments on. They're just so easy to wear and like I love that they have sleeves a lot of the times because most dresses in stores are sleeveless or tank top and I'm not about that life. So these are all very, very comfortable. The last thing I wanna talk about are custom frames. If you go to a place like Michael's, sure you can get a custom frame, but you're probably gonna pay a lot. If you're looking for something that's like 11 by 14 or eight by 10 or um, four by six, you're gonna find that. If you need something custom, you're gonna pay a lot. On Amazon, however, if you time it right, you won't. So I got this picture when I was on the Disney Wish. They gave this to all the media for the Enchanted Showcase. Um, if you wanna see a more in-depth look at this, I will link my cruise haul up in the eye and down below. But it's a weird size, so I needed a custom frame. And the reason I knew Amazon was going to do that is because I have other pieces around my apartment that are custom sizing, and Amazon was the only place I could get one and not pay an arm and a leg. Uh, when I film in my living room, you'll see like there's a bunch of like lithographs from the Disney store. They're a weird size, the old lithographs. I got all those frames on Amazon and usually I think with those now, it's been years since I bought those, they came in four packs and they were the price of what you'd pay for one. So we love that. All right, so I gotta wrap up this video because I do have a Zoom call with one of the companies that I am doing my broadcast for two incredible ones. One is Disney and then we're going to Walt Disney World. One is non-Disney. Oh, I'm really, really excited. So make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any of that magic coming soon. If you're new here, I hope you will subscribe and stick around. We do sprinkle in lifestyle stuff, but we do have a lot of magical Disney fun here. Um, let me know in the comments below, what is something you got recently on Amazon? Or maybe what's your all time favorite purchase you got on Amazon? I would love to know in the comments below. And I'd also love to talk with you over on Instagram. Also, if you haven't reached out to me yet, I think I'm still waiting on two or three of my winners to reach out to me to claim their prize for my 1K giveaway. If you missed that announcement, I'll link that up in the eye and down below. And if you didn't get that, one. I have a little Halloween one that I'm doing right now too. So you can still enter that for a little bit longer. So that video will be up in the eye and down below. Okay. I am all talked out, but thank you so much for watching. Let's go shopping on Amazon. I am Christina Kay. Have a Disney day.